Well, well I am very interested. Here. You know what? I'm very interested in this thing which you said about researching 10 doctors. Oh, really? Please. You want to tell us, tell us subscribers what you actually did. So before that, so we have these two pretty ladies who've come all the way from different parts of the US. And I've been having a great time with them chatting up the last almost one hour, 40 minutes maybe. And uh, we've gone through, of course, their concerns, we've taken the scans and everything. But she told me something that that was goosebumps raising. So I thought she would tell us subscribers. Can you tell us? Yes. Some? Thanks. That I've been doing research for a year, uh -huh. trying to find the proper doctor, and um, I consulted doctors all over the world, in Korea, in Russia, South America, Canada, all over the U.S. Wow! And you, <laughs> and I chose you. And that was that was very touching the way you said it the first time. Um, but anyways, thanks a lot. And so, what was it that? Uh, was anything particular that you felt was better with the way we described pictures of patients or videos of patients or what was it that convinced you? I loved your before and after photos Okay. and I loved how transparent you were. You showed exactly what you did to okay. the patients and what really like made me choose you was how you treat babies. Okay. I love babies. Who doesn't? <laughs> I mean like it's a special doctor to do surgery on a baby. Because you said babies, there was this guy who just came in. It's so unfortunate, but you get to see their kids. Both his twin girls were clamped. Oh. We did his lip, their lips a few months ago. The father just came in, they're gonna get the baby in the next few days. Oh. So you might be able to see. They look so beautiful now. You just showed me the pictures just now, oh. like, like two minutes before. That's lovely. Yeah, so babies are always amazing because you see them grow, you see the uh, I mean, that's the best part, mm -hmm. but also meeting people <laughs> like you to be able to solve some issues that have not been solved earlier, right? Right. And Beatrice, you want to say something? Yes, I was excited to come here. I heard all good things and everybody's been so nice and polite and helpful and I feel very safe and comfortable and I'm excited. <laughs> yeah, so... We're planning a few uh, procedures for her that's going to involve the upper jaw, lower jaw, uh, the chin, and also the angle. So she's also had a chin implant done five years ago, and that was in the US, yes. right? So we're going to uh, take that off and we're going to contour that. We're also going to give her a much more uh, angular, V-line type of a face and reduce the height of the face per se. Uh, so we've done the first part of the consultation, we've done the scanning, I've done the planning, but not fully yet. We need some more time to go through the scans. Um, but we're going to get the cleaning and the models and the pictures done meanwhile. And yes, they've had this long journey. They just caught me a few hours ago, so they're going to get some good sleep. Yes. And we're going to come with more updates. And yes, I'm going to show them this. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't this cool? So this case um, is a gift from her and it's not like she planned it, I just stole it from her <laughs> phone, <laughs> literally. Uh, so I said that case looks nice and she's like, oh dog, you like it, take it. So I've got a new, um, I thought it was a lady's purse, but I think it's now a no, it's box. A trunk. It's a trunk. Yeah, it's a trunk case. It looks really cool, huh? So yeah, thank you. I also got some chocolates. <laughs> That's like a bribe. <laughs> <laughs> this is like stealing. Anyways. <laughs>